weep with this young lady, even though she took my son away. Very emotional. He thought he found love online, but the woman behind the app took his life instead. Last month, Shakira Graham was found guilty of killing Meshach Cornwall after meeting him on a dating app. Well, today the judge sentenced her to life in prison with the possibility of parole after 30 years. News 5's Amanda Van Allen was in the courtroom when it all went down. And Amanda, what did the family of the victim think of the outcome? Well, Danita, the victim's mom tells me she is pleased with the sentence. She poured her heart out to the judge, telling him what an amazing son she had for 27 years. And now the woman who killed the Garfield Heights man will pay the price. It was an emotional day in court. I put my key in my side door, and as I entered my home, I found my 27-year-old son at the bottom of the stairs. Both sides fighting for their loved one. My daughter was raised in a home with pastors. She was taught right from wrong. Meshach Cornwall's mom talked about how much she misses her son. He never forgot a birthday. He never forgot a Christmas. He never forgot a Mother's Day. He gave the best gift and has somehow found a way to forgive the defendant. I my heart grieve for this young lady, even though she took my son away, because she is just so foolish and ignorant to waste her life and to take my son's life, and for what? Even when the victim's mother addressed Shakira Graham directly, she sat stone-faced. She was handcuffed the entire time, and there was a heavy police presence in the courtroom. I know the person that she is. I know my daughter. I, she's not an angel, but I don't believe she's a murderer. But there was a complete 180 in the defendant's demeanor when her dad spoke. She was in tears. I accept the decision of the court, but as her father, as someone who knows her, I do not believe that my daughter committed the act that she has been convicted of. Graham herself addressed the court today. She told the victim's family she is sorry for their loss, but she did not accept responsibility and continues to maintain her innocence. Her attorney plans to file an appeal later this week. Danita?